I am here at White Kaloa Colony Villas, 1506, and I wanted to start outside because what's so wonderful about the outside is you've got direct parking, and then we're going to follow this pathway into the unit. And here again is the beginning of building 15 of the complex. Just the entrance is just so beautiful and so lush. I just wanted to introduce you to 1506 this way with the walkway. So here's our entrance, which makes it feel very private and very secluded, which is wonderful. This is at the corner of the unit. So the whole building is here. So we're, again, we're at the corner of the unit, very private, very lush walking in, which is really nice. Again, we've got this bench that's here, so you can take our shoes off. And then we've got our entrance. So what's different about this one, this one is a primary residence. So you'll see a lot more care and, and a lot more care and kind of taking care of, excuse me, nicer furniture, nicer upgrades. This is your entrance, your foyer, a nice dark blue entryway. Nice entry kind of area there. Beautiful flooring. The flooring for this one is just gorgeous. Same floor plan as previous. We've got 1,236 square feet. One bedroom upstairs, bathroom upstairs, and then also a bedroom and bathroom downstairs. This one they've done just such great splashes of that blue to really highlight those vaulted ceilings. They've got art, great artwork and furniture. They've upgraded a lot of the appliances, the AC system. Oh, you've got white carpet, which is kind of a bummer if you're trying to rental. And then you've got your dining area here. And another blue splash for your kitchen and direct access to your garage you've got again the one bedroom one bathroom downstairs around the corner there and then one bedroom bathroom upstairs upstairs let's go look at our lanai which we love what's great about this one is a golf view so very quiet very beautiful we've got some nice plants and water feature here Let's see if you can see this a little bit better here. This is what we're selling here is this just beautiful golf view. So I feel very private. It's very quiet. The road is, there's a hedge here, there's the golf course, and then there's the main road there. If I listen carefully, I, see a, I hear a little bit of road noise. Just kind of the cars going back and forth there. It's the next building over. So I really don't see maybe their lanai a little bit. So it doesn't feel like I'm intruding on anybody. The next lanai is just right over these bushes where all this vegetation is. So you don't really feel like we're with them. And this is the AC for the unit, very upgraded AC unit. Those are about 15,000. This one has some tint on these slider so it helps keep that sun out kind of another way to see the open floor plan dining room kitchen living area this one's a little darker in the living room there's no lights on in the living room but it still has enough natural light you don't have to turn on a light in there too much if you need don't need it so upgraded refrigerator Upgraded dishwasher in this one. Here's your view from the sink. You've got tile on the floor there. Lots of cabinetry. And then we'll go see if we can get into the garage. Might be locked, might not. No, since they're here, perfect. One car garage. Oh good, you can see it with a car in there. And they've got nice storage on along the side there. Nice shelving, can really do a lot. And the water heater is just around the corner there. Upgraded water heater. They do have garage door openers as well. Here in this one, we'll have your washer and dryer and storage. They have a nice new Kenmore washer. 
nice storage area. Again, this is right to the right of the kitchen there. So you have the laundry room and you have the bathroom right here by the kitchen and living room, which is great. And then you do have a guest room or office down here. Simple bathroom, but nice and clean. Looks like it's in fabulous shape. You've got good eyes on coloring, which is nice to see. The toilet looks like it's been upgraded. You've got another storage unit here. And then your downstairs bedroom. The floors are beautiful. This one feels much larger, I like where they pushed this bed to the wall so this area is all open. This to me looks like maybe a double bed. Beautiful artwork. These blinds are a little bit better. They're wood, so they're having to upgrade from that plastic, which is nice. Your view here is that kind of bush area there. And then you've got another bush here, so very private. We don't see the neighbors at all because of the bushes that are right there. I have to look way up to see the neighbors. And then another large closet. You know, I haven't opened any of the closets. Might as well just open one. And then you've got the shelf on the top there, classic closet. So a good thing about this one is if you do want to rent it, you're automatically allowed to get the permit for a short term permit. You just have to pay the fee of the 506. It does take about 90 days to get that permit approved, but you're automatically approved because you're in the resort. All right, so we were downstairs in the living room kitchen, one bedroom downstairs. We're gonna go upstairs to the primary bedroom and bathroom. This one has the cute little nooks there. Another window for more natural light. It's kind of a very light, subtle blue on the wall there. It's kind of a bluish gray. Really love the artwork right there. So it looks like the carpet goes all the way through to the bedrooms. You have a Honeywell system there. And your primary bedroom, very light. Oh my gosh, it feels very comfortable. It's, I thought it was a blue, but maybe it's a purple on the wall. I guess it's a purple. I'm not quite sure if it's a purple and a blue. They're very subtle colors. Shows very well. Just beautiful. That's your view. And let's go peek on this lanai here. Two chairs that fit just perfectly. You probably have to turn them to the side because your knee is there. This is your view here. Different looking at another condo. You're looking here at the golf course. I guess you got some golfers away in the background there. So just a really sweet view. Nice airflow there. room shows very well very clean and then let's look at our primary bathroom you've got a walk-in closet and a peek at their stuff it looks like it's closed you've got storage unit here your tub and toilet and shower. Again, we are here at Colony Villas 2101. This one is a primary residence, so it's in really good shape. It's been upgraded more. That's why you'll see that price is a little bit higher. Where am I going? We got the walk-in closet there. It's got their stuff in it, so we can't go in there. And we'll go back downstairs. This is the primary bedroom and bathroom upstairs. And then downstairs is that second bedroom. And we'll go out to that lanai again. So I think that's what's really the, one of the most beautiful things about this feature, other than all the upgrades and the flooring, 
is the lanai and the location. Oops. And I'll go outside and just peek up the other way so you can get a different view of the lanai here. And then these are tile homes, so we were upstairs on that lanai there, the upstairs downstairs. The water feature is so nice. You can hear it. <laughs> I like the red ginger, it's pretty. Again, we're here at 2101. Two bedroom, two bath. One is downstairs, one is upstairs. This one is selling for $1,120 does not have a short-term permit. Aloha.